how do I create a subdomain? Let's have a look at what a subdomain is and then we'll begin setting one up. Okay, so a subdomain is used to split up your website address and can be used to direct customers to different parts of your website. So, for example, support.123-reg.co.uk will be a subdomain of 123-reg.co.uk. This means that when visitors type in this subdomain, they will be directed straight to the support site instead of the main 123-reg website. To begin creating your subdomain, you'll need to be logged in to your 123-reg control panel. Scroll down to the web hosting section and select your domain name using the drop-down menu. Now click on the Manage button. This opens up your web hosting control panel. Have a look in the Web Tools section and click on Subdomains. In the Domain Name field, enter the part that will come before your domain name. So, using the subdomain from the example, we'll type in Support. If you wish for the subdomain to map to a different part of your website, then you will need to type in the name of the directory here. The directory is the name of the folder where your website files are stored. If you can't remember the name of it, have a look in your file manager. You can access this using your web hosting control panel. OK, so if you are creating a subdomain that will sit alongside your existing domain name, then keep the directory as it is. This will mean that both your subdomain and domain name will point to your website. Once you've finished entering this information, simply click on the Create button. That's it. Your subdomain has now been created. This means that when someone types it into their browser, they will be directed to the section of the website that you have mapped the subdomain to. Want to see more videos like this? Well, check out the 123 Ridge Support Centre for helpful videos and step-by-step -step tutorials. Don't forget, you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel for regular updates.